Hallstatt is a small, centuries-old town that sits on the shores of a lake and is guarded by towering mountain peaks. It is not only known as the Old Town. It has also been named the most beautiful town in Austria. Hallstatt is home to approximately 778 residents. It is located on the western shore of Lake Hallstatt and covers an area of more than 855 square kilometers. The town's traditional houses, lined up neatly on the lakeshore in bright colors, are particularly beautiful. The houses are built of wood and stone and are neatly laid out along narrow, winding streets. The town's architecture has been preserved for centuries and is one of the best examples of traditional Austrian architecture. The buildings in this town reflect a deep history and evoke an enchanting aura of the past. Hallstatt is a living museum that encapsulates the cultural heritage and local wisdom that has transcended time. This town is a place where time seems to have stopped for a moment, to then provide a sense of peace and beauty that is very admirable. Thanks to its beauty, this town has hosted more than one million tourists every year. They come to this place, not only to enjoy its beauty and rich history, but because Hallstatt is also said to have inspired the famous Disney film, entitled Frozen. As a remote village, Hallstatt has limited access. However, the history of access to Hallstatt has changed over time, as well as the development of transport technology. In the past, due to its remote location in a mountainous region, access to Hallstatt was very limited. Before modern roads, access to the town was via water transport. Hallstatt's lake just to the side of the town provided an important transport route for the exchange of goods and transport. Locals used boats to travel between the villages along the lake. In fact, until the end of the 19th century, traveling to Hallstatt was only possible via boats and narrow roads. However, with the development of technology and transport infrastructure, access to the city has improved considerably. Hallstatt has an asphalt road, making it possible for cars or buses to reach the city more easily. Although the highway to Hallstatt is quite narrow and winding in mountainous terrain, this fact does not detract from a comfortable drive. Hallstatt has been inhabited since Neolithic times, around 5,000 years BC. As such, it is one of the oldest cities in Europe. The city has a long history that can be traced through various museums and historical sites. As such, Hallstatt was honored as a World Heritage Site by UNESCO in 1997. The city's name derives from Hallstatt culture, a period in European history that began around 800 to 400 BC. Hallstatt's earliest cultural epoch, dating back to around 800 BC, was characterized by a highly developed knowledge of salt and iron mining and a thriving trade exchange. In 1846, an ancient cemetery was discovered in Hallstatt, which became an important discovery for the understanding of ancient European history. This discovery, consisting of tombs rich in artifacts, included jewelry, weapons, and household items. About 1,300 burials were discovered, including about 2,000 people, including women and children. 
The discovery of these tombs provides a deep understanding of the life, customs, and craftsmanship of the time. About the oldest known salt mines in the world. Salt had immense economic value at the time, as it was used as a food preservative, currency, spiritual and ceremonial purposes. Hallstatt salt was therefore not only a source of food for its inhabitants, but also a source of wealth. The exploitation of the mines became an important factor in the economy and development of the city. As this product, being an important item of trade in Europe, helped expand trade networks, as well as cultural contacts. Despite being known as a very beautiful city and an ancient salt mining center that is still active today, the local people of Hallstatt are not only actively involved in the mining and tourism sectors, but also in trade and agriculture. Some of Hallstatt's residents are still involved in agricultural activities, albeit on a smaller scale. Typically the agricultural sector includes animal husbandry, vegetable farming, and fruit farming. But of course, a large part of the city's economy depends on tourism. Tourist visits to this beautiful city are very important for the local economy. Because of this, many residents work in the tourism industry, such as hotels, restaurants, souvenir shops, and other tourist services. But remarkably, even though the city is always bustling with tourists, the residents of Hallstatt still maintain a traditional lifestyle in many aspects. Traditional architecture in beautiful buildings, as well as local traditions such as festivals and cultural events are still well preserved by the locals.